All right, and welcome to part three of episode one, Hero in Residence. A llama? Awesome! We found it! Oh, your owner is gonna be so happy to see you. Wait, let me get this straight. This quest was just to track down a stupid llama? <coughs> it's not just a stupid llama. It's, uh, it's important, okay? It's apparently like a uh, treasure-sniffing llama, or, uh, it's important, okay? Please, just trust me. We just need to bring her back to her owner. It doesn't need to be like a thing. Okay, okay, I'm sorry. If you say it's important, then I trust you. Yeah? Yeah. Aw, she likes it. Now, somebody. how about we get you out of here, huh? Come here, Llama. What you get for wearing that dork armor. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll have to craft a new set. Dang. Let's get this thing. Don't let it get away. Just grab the... Oh. Gross. Come on. Get after that armor wrecking thing. Uh, hang on, it's super dark down there. We should make a torch. Why am I always the one that has to build something? Here, llama, llama, llama. Where'd you go? After you. Mayor Jesse, I told you I'm not the mayor. I'm the leader and hero in residence. I know, I know. It's just that you do a lot of paperwork and like town running things. How the heck did you get up there? Who knows? But it's coming down now. Was that creepy whisper? Uh, I didn't hear anything. sort of glove or a gauntlet looks like it's made out of prismarine a prismarine but you only find that at the bottom of the ocean whoa ah! how did where what 
is this thing? I don't know. I, I don't know. It, it, it seems like it's not hurting you, and that's good. It looks kind of... Okay, actually, it looks really cool. Uh, w which I know might not be what you want to hear right now. It's not hurting me, but it keeps making these weird whispers. I haven't heard anything. Well, uh, here. I'll help you take it off. Come on! Okay. Ow! Wow! Stop! That thing is really stuck. I just can't shake this feeling that maybe you were meant to find that gauntlet. Like, maybe it was your destiny or something. Man, what are the odds? Command blocks? Portal keys? Why is it always me? <laughs> I don't know, but there's definitely a pattern. Uh-oh. Get off the pyramid, quick! See the bottom. Ugh, gives me the willies. And what's that sound coming from down there? Yep. Wow. That is bottomless. Well, we can't just leave something like this exposed. We should cover it up. Yeah, agreed. Sure, but I'm getting a bad feeling that it's the actual way we're going to fix this. On second thought, let's talk about it anywhere but in here. Not getting out the way we came, though. Don't tell me you guys can't... There! Come on! close to Beacon Town. Here, uh, maybe you could leave a warning or something? Why me? Straight to the point. I like it. Okay, then. <clears throat> what do we do about all this? Well, it's all made of prismarine, right? And you only find that in, like, monuments and stuff at the bottom of the ocean. Yeah. There's a treasure hunter in Beacon Town named Jack. Kind of a legend. He knows everything about prismarine, exploring the ocean. Because we definitely can't have that happening again. That was... That was really bad. Damn. I know you're giving me that look you give me when you think I'm crazy, but I swear, I think this guy's our best shot at solving this prismarine problem. And I'll take you to Jack's shop as soon as I'm back. But first, I really need to deal with this llama. Okay, come on you. Gotta get you home. But what about my hand? This thing won't come off. I, yeah, I, I know, I know, but this llama. Why is that llama so important to you? You know my sword? Gold one, with all the enchantments? Miss Butter? Yeah, I, I kinda got tricked by this person named Stella. Said she just wanted to put it on display for a little while. And 
Now she won't give it back until I do dumb quests like this for her. It's, uh, it's been not great. Hoping this is the end of it. Petra, why didn't you tell me about this? You haven't exactly been around much. Didn't want to bother you with it. So, yeah, her, her name's Stella, and she's kind of obsessed with treasure. She says this is her treasure-sniffing llama, or... She runs a place called Champion City. Wait, like Champion City right over there? I had no idea their leader was like that. Yeah, she's ambitious. And she's willing to do anything to get her way. Bullying, lying, cheating. Without my sword, I just really need to get it back. Just hope Stella actually gives it back this time. We're the Order of the Stone, Petra. Looking out for each other is what we do. That's fair. Thanks, Jesse. Come on. I can't wait to meet this Stella myself. Yeah. Okay. Let's do it. Then, freshly rearmed, we'll come back, sort out that heck mouth, and... Get this thing off my hand! <laughs> Get this thing off my hand! Champion City. Every single one of those apartments up there is exactly the same. Stella is strict about how things look here. Wow, this is super impressive. Good layout, great colors. If you're into that sort of thing. <laughs> what? Come on, we're almost there. It's like she doesn't want to go see Stella. I don't know how she feels. I just really need this to go well. And with Stella, well, it doesn't most times. Hey, that's why you've got me, remember? We're a team, and we will take care of this no problem. Sure hope you're right. Anyway, Stella usually has her office hours in the center of the courtyard. Well, I hope she's ready for an appointment with Jesse and Petra. Stella. Yes, that's right. Puppies for everyone. No shoving now. We're not beacon towners. <laughs> You've probably put this together right now, but Stella's pretty fond of herself. I would play to her ego. Oh, well, that is a cute one. And he could be all yours. Provided you have the right payment, of course. Oh, she matches your outfit wonderfully. I know you think you look... You. Oh, Luna, my darling! You came home. You came back. Uh, Rodrigo, could you bring Luna home, please? There's a good girl. Stella. Oh, look who it is! Jesse, leader of Beacon Town, and my sworn rival. I've never met her before, right? No. Our rivalry, Beacon Town versus Champion City? Surely you think about it as much as I do? Oh boy. Yes, that's right, my rival. I am here to finally meet face to face. Yeah, that's what I thought. I love the glove, by the way. Absolutely, darling. You wouldn't be interested in trading, would you? 
Got some fine puppies here. All free range, of course. Oh, I really wish I could. Really. But I can't. Oh, too bad. They're very cute puppies. And, you know, I heard you need new pets, so... Okay, hold it. Oh, Petra, you're here too. I almost thought Luna just came back on her own. What do I owe you? A puppy? No, that wasn't... A diamond, maybe? No, I... An emerald. <laughs> Don't push too hard now. Don't make me get tough here, Stella. You know what Petra wants. Yeah, We're Petra. not leaving without that sword. Wait, is this about... Oh, Petra? Oh, sweetie, no. I was very clear. I make trades for treasures. I think I'm all done here. You said you just wanted to display it. I thought I could still use it. Oh, no, honey, no. <laughs> you wanted to become my champion. You came to me, remember? In exchange, you got to live here instead of Beacon Town. Isn't that nice? Oh, no, was that supposed to be a secret? <laughs> oh, dear. Petra, sweetie. Oh, we are going to talk about this later, Petra. Uh, I know. Well, I think it's about time I go back to my treasure hall, Jesse. By the way, way nicer than yours. Do you two know the way out? Oh, what am I saying? Of course Petra does. If you ever want a place in Champion City, just ask. <laughs> like I said, she's the worst. Hey, you're the one that decided to live here. I... Yeah, I deserve that. Like you said, let's talk about it later. Right now, I really need to figure out how I'm going to get my sword back. I just don't know how we're going to do that. Stella's treasure room is right there. But I've got a bad feeling about those bodyguards of hers. Could probably sneak in through the puppy kennel, but that's a lot of barking puppies. There's got to be a way. We'll roll in, fight the bodyguards, snag the sword, get out again. Piece of cake. I like the sound of that. Hey, you can't be in here. And you definitely can't have those. Let's get fire out! it up. I don't like you. Ha! Not a fan of yours either. We still really need to talk about this, Petra. You really want to discuss it now? Yes, I do. It does seem like weird timing. Shush. Hey, shush you. I'm trying <clears throat> to have a conversation here. <laughs> this whole Champion City thing is kind of a big deal, don't you think? Is it though? So I have a house here. So what? Hey, what's going on out here? Uh, <laughs> so what? I feel like you're deflecting the issue. Uh, me? Yes. No, not you. Yipes. What about not wanting to be tied down? What about your friends? You mean the friends who are never around anymore? What did you say? No matter what happens, no matter how much I do, you're the big hero. You probably don't even remember what it's like adventuring out there, scrounging for resources. Just look at today. We were supposed to go on one adventure, and you were late. I can't even get my friends to spend time with me. Do you know how it feels to show up for quest after quest, and just hearing, Oh man, I'm sorry, next time, next time. Come on, Petra, do you really think that's fair? We have lives. I have a whole town depending on me. Ah, uh, no, it wasn't. You might have a point. This is Stella's treasure room? Yeah. 
Trophy heads, gold pants, sponge blocks, a diamond hoe? Yep, all bought from other people. Half of them still have the name tags of other people on them. Okay, now I'm just getting mad. Being a hero and being cool is more than just having a room full of treasure. Especially treasure you got from other people. I know one treasure she doesn't get to keep, though. Should be... No! Where'd it go? Where'd she put it? You're sure it was here? <clears throat> so, our rivalry escalates again. Yes, I suppose it does. I can't let you continue your nefarious ways. Exactly what I'd expect from you, my nemesis. You shouldn't be here. Well, you shouldn't be such a jerk. Guess we're all disappointed. Okay, okay, fine. Just take it. Take the stupid sword. I've got better treasure than that anyway. Who needs it? You couldn't stop me if you wanted to. That sword is ours. So classy. Just remember that you had to beat up on an innocent, beautiful civic leader to get it. I won't forget this, Jesse. History will remember this as an important day in our rivalry. Fine. That's right. The day I reclaimed the upper hand. Curse you, Jesse! Classic rival. Rah! Feels so good to have you back. Thank you so much for your help. I know it got a little weird back there. I appreciate you still helping me anyway. Hey, it's all in the past, Petra. Just happy to reunite you with your favorite deadly weapon. Oh, yeah. and it feels so good. What is that? Charged? That should be impossible. Tell them that. Uh. Ah. Cheap sword. I got you covered, Jesse. Ah. So good to have you back. No, you don't. Ugh. Wow. There's a million of Ooh. them. That would have been dumb if it wasn't so awesome. Come on. We need to get this thing covered up again. we're going to get this to hold. That heck mouth blew right through the ground. First your prismarine gauntlet, then that prismarine pit spitting out creepers. We need to get to Jack's fast. Yeah, I hope this treasure hunter knows as much as you say he does. He does. He's gotta. Come on, I'll show you the way. Welcome to Bad Luck Alley. Wow, I didn't even know people hung out down here at night. Well, yeah, it's the cool part. What's that supposed to mean? Oh, uh, you know, these are the people who like to live off the grid, outside the rules. And you're kind of the boss. It's just the way the world works. That's like the trade-off when you're in charge. You know that. Well, I really appreciate you showing me. 
I know this is like your thing or whatever, and it's nice of you to share. <laughs> you are such a cornball, but no problem. Cornball, come on! All right, everybody, thank you for watching this video, and I, we appreciate all the support you've given us. And please check out our uh, playlist, you know, the next video, Patreon page, and random video. I don't know why. It's random, so don't go with it. And also, please like and comment and subscribe to this video, and subscribe to our channel, of course, not subscribe to the video. Right, and that's